CES 2026. My name is Noel. I'm here at the World Unveil, world premiere of Cosmera. And I'm here with Simon, the design team that made this come to life, that make these vehicles look like they do. Simon, thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. Thank you for taking some time to talk to us, looking at these. I mean, first of all, how do you feel after, I don't know how many months of design, of reiteration, to finally see the dream? Let's start with a joke. <laughs> I won't crash into my bed. <laughs> it's, it's really tiring, something, but uh, it's also exciting and proud of the team, how it comes within sh such short of time. It's amazing work, everybody. You know, those two cars, the chief designers, are two young ladies. Ooh. They're hot workers and all the team yes. contributes a lot. Love to see love to see that representation. Love to see that more ladies. I mean, we already know that the ladies have more style than us in a lot of ways. Mm -hmm. So it's just natural for them to, you know, design things that style. It, you know, because nowadays the cars are a lot more stylish than yes. they used to be back then. They're not just boxes anymore. They're like, every time you see a car, every new car that comes out, it's like a work of art. Mm -hmm. So who best to do it than the people who naturally have more style than us anyway. So I think that's a good thing. Now, what can you, I mean, I don't even know where to start looking at this magnificent piece of art. Thank you. Um, Thank you. What can you tell me, like, what was your inspiration to the design, the overall okay. of this vehicle. Okay, when we come to the car design, the first and the most critical things okay. is the propulsion. Okay. It has very strong stand and the super propulsion. That's, it's very low, it's over two meters wide. Yes. And uh, the wheelbase, you know, is about 3.2 meters long. And uh, that's enable the car to have a very strong attitude towards the people. I'm here. Yeah. The X16. I mean, what I like about it, just looking at it, is like you said, the proportion, the size, the width, and the length of it. Uh, we had a little bit of a um, surprise, which the founder of the group company stopped by, and okay. you got a chance to. Sh was that the first time he was seeing the car in real life? Uh, he had been reviewed the car for several times. Yeah. So it's not a surprise, but uh, for the actual full elements yeah it's the first time the car. i mean even like how, how do you feel because i saw him i saw his face he looked very pleased that would be our place too <laughs> yeah know? i mean yeah. it looks really it, he looks like he was he wanted to just drive it off <laughs> uh, what we're working for gotcha gotcha and not only that the future real customers the smell on their face yeah it's are our goals that uh that brings me up to the next question is that what it, what was the um, what drive you guys to get into to build these two cars? What is the goal? Like you said, what's the ultimate goal? What do you want? What is something that maybe you see was missing in the maybe the grand touring car or the electric car or the super? Like there's something that you guys saw that was missing, and you're like, we think we can provide that value to the customer. Yes. What was that? Uh, I think for electric car, the high performance is a kind of a common understanding for everyone, right? Electrics yeah. meets uh, a lot of uh, power. Instant speed, yeah, instant, instant power. Instant speed, yeah. instant power. Uh, that's one reason, but everyone is doing, doing that. The yeah. second reason is that we are a tech company. So we try to integrate the meta world into the car. Uh -huh. Just the one okay. like we show on the, uh, on the presentation, the track mode. That's the only one application. Actually, there are more scenarios that can open our mind to make people driving it with a lot of that fun and pleasures. On just said on the pamphlet over there, you, your it's your motto, your mission said we listen to what people love about cars because we see it all the time. Like you have a car, you love the car, but you're like, ah, oh, it would be great if it didn't do that, or if it could do that, or if it had that feature. So uh -huh. you guys take all of those feedback. Okay. And you cr put it all, tr well, you try to put it all in one package. <laughs> See, you, you can't satisfy everyone, right? Yeah. So we will collect the information and we will make selections. The, the one or the several most was uh, mentioned, uh, we will try to apply it or fix it. Yeah. And of course, designers, uh, we're professionals. Yes. We, we offer the basic beauty of the car. That's something it's must beautiful. be. <laughs> and with all the comments, we use our way to refine it and make it more beautiful. 
Understood. Okay, so now the power plant on this vehicle, it's a 350 kilowatt motor on each wheel. Yes, times it would four. be by four. Yeah. yeah, so that that provides a total of 2,040 40 horsepower. 2,040 horsepower in this that's that's an achievement that's an achievement now i have a question regarding this window i've been looking at the driver what okay. the front windows okay and they are not necessarily the back window is uh, much longer than the yes. front that yes. that design style is interesting you guys said by the end of q4 2026 planning to have a full version on the track testing yeah. ready for okay yeah. so is there more design refining that needs to happen or is this what's going to be released eventually and definitely there will be more refinement in, okay in, including the ergonomics and okay. uh, for this uh showcase or for this concept why we have an extra look like a, a extra longer right because we want uh get attention of a premium class okay it, it, we, we have a long wheelbase like a two points uh, 3.2 meters, yes, right? Yeah. We show maximum of the uh, rear space to show, okay, it's not only for you drive crazy on the track, but the daily use, you have a really premium, relaxed uh, space for yourself at the rear seats. Okay, yes, because it looks like the, the passengers in the back are going to be having more fun yeah. than the person in the front seat. They can sit back and relax. Yeah. But in the front seat, the, the cockpit is very well positioned that you feel, even though the vehicle is uh, big <laughs> you still feel in control that yes. it doesn't seem like you don't know the proportion where your car starts now remember we mentioned that they unveiled two different cars the star matrix and the star razor the star matrix is what we're looking at it looks a little bit bulky a little bit bigger and tougher this is the star razor it's sleeker it's refined it is sharp let's take a closer look Okay, so my most important question while watching the trailer was the spoiler. Okay. Can okay. you explain us more about it? Yeah, actually, uh, it looks like a spoiler, but yeah. actually it's a rare hatch door uh -huh. open in this way and uh, allowed to reach things much easier. So more like a trunk, yeah. Yeah, it's more, almost like a trunk. And also this trunk will slide out. We designed oh, so some kind of uh, box and unit yeah, yeah, yeah. to this store, the robots. Mm. And they will release the robots out automatically. That, that's pretty intense. And like, I love the design and also like the fly wings, fly doors. Like, uh, what was the idea behind? Um, actually, um, for a show car, you need ice catcher. Yeah. So that would be one accent to make people get interesting at it. But it's it's not like uh, alien technology. We can use it. Yeah, it's a normal like technology. Car. Yes. And also, I feel like that gives a better entry for rear seats also. Yes, yes, exactly. Now, as you can see, the interior is simple. It is clean and it's dripping with Alcantara and carbon fiber everywhere. The whole chassis is made out of aluminum and then all of the panels are carbon fiber. That is why a vehicle of that size only weighs 1990 kilogram the star matrix rear passenger compartment is a full three seater so the whole car can hold five passengers comfortably unlike the star matrix that the back is a cockpit design that has a center console which only allow for two seats although cut from the same block these vehicles are significantly different from one another and what was the top speed for this one comparing the other one same yeah, same, same same top speed yes okay yes this one might be a little bit longer, about 20 centimeters longer than that car, mm -hmm. but kind of the same, same. Okay. And it will go probably into production at the same time than the other one? Uh, Approximately. Probably. We will make a decision by the market reaction. See what's, okay, yeah, yeah. which one is going to be better. And which maybe, one people are more interested in? Yeah, so if it's really well received both, and um, we will try maybe cooperate with other partners to have some of yeah. this one built in different brand in factory maybe. Yeah, and I mean with the design, with the carbon fiber and the lights, the rear lights in front, like you had to come out with a bold design to yep. get the attention of the sure. people. Yeah, sure, to, to test the, the, the edge of the technology yeah, yeah, yeah. and how we can execute it. Oh, yeah. hey Simon, I think you guys did an amazing job. I'd love to see it. Thank you for taking a few minutes to uh, talk to us. I cannot wait for the next step and hopefully at the end of the of the year we can go for a test drive. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming. Thank Let's you. Keep